Hello everyone, welcome to Informatica support videos. So in this video, we're going to talk about how to load metadata into enterprise data catalog using remote or also known as uh, offline scanners. So coming to the agenda, first we're going to talk about remote scanners, then we'll talk about the steps to configure these remote scanners, then we'll proceed for a, a quick demo. So first, what are remote scanners? We can't use our regular catalog service to extract data from offline or inaccessible resources. So in those type of instances, Informatica has a standalone scanner utility where we can uh, use that to extract metadata from these type of offline resources. So the utility contains a script and where we need to run multiple commands in a specific order. Now coming to the sources of this remote scanner. We can use remote scanners to get metadata from cloud sources like Amazon Redshift, S3, and Azure sources, or else we can extract the data from business intelligence sources like IBM Cognos, MicroStrategy, Oracle Business Intelligence, or uh, the regular DBMSs like Oracle, SQL Server, IBM DB2, SAP HANA, Sybase, Teradata, etc. Now, coming to the steps to configure these remote scanners first of all uh, we need to extract the scanner utility, utility from the domain machine to the source system so once we extracted the utility then we need to generate a resource config file and then we need to encrypt the password so in this case uh, we can't use our regular password so we need to encrypt it before uh, we are running the remote scanner so once the step one and step two are configured, then we need to validate the connection. So validating the connection is nothing else but doing a test connection of the resource config file. So once we may test, test connection is performed, then uh, we can use the metadata archive command to extract the metadata. So once the metadata is been extracted, move the metadata file from source system to the domain machine again. So once that has been done, let's publish the file into the catalog. Now we'll proceed for a quick demo. Okay, so first log into your ADC domain machine and go to Infa Home Services Catalog Service and then into the scanner CLA utility directory. So under this directory, you'll find the EIC scanner CLA utility dot zip. Now unzip the EIC scanner CLI utility.zip into a separate folder. Now uh, copy this extracted directory from the EDC domain machine to the remote scanner source machine. After copying the directory into the offline source, go to the extracted directory and go to bin and under bin run the scanner.sh command to generate the resource config file so in this case i'm going to run the offline scanner for oracle resource so my command is going to be as follows So we'll provide the scanner.sh generate resource config and we'll provide the resource type and the output where we want the configuration file to be present. After the command run is successful, now encrypt your user password. This is an important step. So we can encrypt the user password uh, using the following command scanner.sh encrypt password and the, pa and the password we, which you want to encrypt. After that, uh, go to the output directory where your resource config file is present and open the resource config file. In the resource config file, uh, Input all the data like the resource name, the description, 
and the oracle user password here make sure to enter the encrypted password and all the other details are similar to what we have in the catalog administrator after inputting the data into the resource config file go to under scanner under remote scanner directory go to scanner jars external dependencies and oracle server under this directory place the odbc jar file after placing the jar file perform the test connection so to perform the test connection go to bin directory and run the following command so scanner.sh validate and the location of the resource config file after that copy the scanner binaries from your edc domain machine to the cli remote scanner directory after placing the binaries under the scanner binaries directory we can uh, proceed to proceed to run the scan command so the scan command is as follows scanner.sh scan rcf and provide the input location of your resource config file and for the output uh, provide an empty directory after the scan is successful go to the output directory mentioned in the above command and under under that directory go to output and here uh, you will find the our publish file now copy this publish file from your remote scanner source to your edc domain machine after copying the publish file to the domain machine go to the remote scanner extract, extract directory go to bin and run the following command to publish the extracted file to the catalog so here scanner.sh publish archive and the username password and make sure to provide the encrypted password here it doesn't take the user password as it is we need to encrypt it provide the security domain and the domain host domain port the domain node the catalog service name and the resource name make sure to provide the same resource name which you have inputted in the resource config file and the path of the archive file after the publish task is successful go to your catalog machine go to catalog ui and you can view all the extracted assets from the remote scanner you can follow these kb articles to find more information about remote scanners thank you very much and we would always love to hear from you please use the following links to provide your suggestions thank you